This week, I'm in beautiful Massachusetts with my great friend, Brian Hudkins. Brian is joining me from New York and is giving me the incredible gift of his time to serve as a cameraman, a gift I surely don't deserve. We'll be hunting public ground this week. I hunted this area last year, and I'm hoping my scouting will pay early dividends this year. We're jumping into my first day at about 9 a.m. At this point, I've located birds on the roost but couldn't do anything with them. So I've moved to another location and hit a series of yelps that were immediately answered with a gobble, and he's close. We scrambled to get the camera set up, but unfortunately Brian didn't have a good angle to see the bird. So we're looking through my gun camera on this first hunt. Brian forgot to load my gun for me. He, he invited me out here and he's got me a place to stay and fixed me breakfast. It made me think he was just going to take care of everything. And he didn't load my gun. You got never, to save yourself, Trout. Never coming back here. <laughs> That's a zero on the Yelp review. Well, it's all silent this morning. Didn't hear a bird, but I do appreciate how Brian <laughs> wears that stupid feather. Just to remind me if that's, that's all that we're taking home of that bird. I haven't missed a turkey since I was 14 years old, and this is a really hard pill to swallow. When you're in beautiful country like this, with one of your best friends ever by your side, how upset can you be? Besides, I had a hunch that we were going to find birds in a nearby field, so we proceeded very cautiously to approach the field, and it's a good thing we did.
you, Lord. What an awesome morning, man. It's a beautiful spot to shoot for. Yeah, it is. It's epic. The last three days of my hunt had a downward trend. Brian had to head back to New York, I was homesick to see my kiddos, and I hadn't heard one gobble. The morning was cold, windy, and again silent, so I gave thanks for the turkey I had already shot and said goodbye to the 2022 season. But on my way back to the truck, this guy caught my eye. This bird is on private ground, and to bag him, I'm going to have to convince him to walk 200 yards across the pasture, hop over the rock wall, and walk to the boundary of the public land upon which I'm standing, all within an hour's time so I can make my flight. I've found what I was hoping for, a hole in the wall. My strategy is to call the bird to this hole and as he approaches, to drop back where I can call him across the boundary onto public land where I can legally take him. Baby, <laughs> yeah, yeah. baby, baby, how's the camera, Brian? <laughs> yeah. yeah, thank you, Lord. Well, how awesome! It was so I uh, set up down just when it looked like my season was over. The Lord had one more gift to deliver, and so the 2022 season ended with a bang on my last hunt. As I record this, my buddy Brian's son, Shepard, is in the fight of his life against cancer. It's a difficult season for my dear friend, and it's a reminder to us all to be thankful for every happy moment we share together and to never take anything for granted. Shepard, the grace and courage you have shown as you face your battle will forever be an inspiration to those that know you. May God heal your body and encourage all of us to follow your example.